It's difficult to match Switzerland for breathtaking alpine landscapes and small towns brimming with fairy tale charm. This landlocked country is endowed with a fairy tale beauty by the towering Alps, glistening blue lakes, verdant valleys, glaciers, and charming lakeside hamlets. World class resorts with a lengthy range of activities, such as hiking, bicycling, climbing, paragliding, skiing, and tobogganing, are tucked away among the mountain valleys and lakes. With its neat packaging and reputation for punctuality, Switzerland can sometimes feel like multiple countries in one, from the Italian architecture of palm studded Ticino to the dialects of Swiss German and Latin derived Romance. Discover this magnificent nation by watching our film on the top Swiss sites and must-see locations. 1. The Matterhorn One of the tallest mountains in the Alps is the Matterhorn, the distinctive pointed peak of Switzerland. This fabled hill, which reaches a height of 4,478 meters near the Italian border, has four steep slopes that face the cardinal directions. The first summit attempt in 1865 was sadly cut short when four climbers died while descending. Today, tens of thousands of knowledgeable climbers visit here every summer. The small community of Zermatt, a major international resort with horse-drawn carriage rides, attractive chalets, and top-notch restaurants and hotels, is located at the base of this powerful peak. Motorized vehicles are not allowed in the hamlet in order to preserve the atmosphere of serenity and good air quality. Skiers have access to more than 300 kilometers of slopes in the winter. Tennis, swimming, and mountain climbing in the nearby mountains are all popular summertime activities. There is also summer glacier skiing accessible. 2. John for Jock, the top of Europe, the train ride to Jumferjock, the top of Europe, with an observation deck and scientific observatory positioned at 3,454 meters, is one of the most well-liked activities in the stunning Bernese Oberland. The Great Alech Glacier, which starts in Jumferjock and is the longest glacier in Europe, is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. At the base of the North Face, the famed Eiger Trail wins its way from the Eiger Glacier Station to Alpaglen. Picturesque, a fantastic starting point for mountain excursions, is the glacier village of Grindelwald in the Jumfrau area. One of the oldest and most well-known resorts in Switzerland, it is nestled at the foot of snow-covered mountains. The tiara-shaped Wetterhorn and the Eiger's sheer north face, one of the world's most spectacular and challenging climbs, tower over this alpine valley. The two gleaming glaciers of Grindelwald are located between the Alps. With its 2,681 meters, the Fallhorn provides the best views of the towering Alps. 3. Interlaken One of Switzerland's most well-liked summer vacation destinations is Interlaken, which is tucked between Lake Thun to the west and Lake Brienz to the east. Hohemat, a 35-acre open space in the middle of the city, is a miracle of urban design. Around the Hohueg, the major thoroughfare through here with breathtaking mountain views are flower gardens, hotels, and cafes. The Eiger, Monch, and Jumfrau, which loom above the town, offer fantastic options for alpine excursions. The main activities include hiking, climbing, abseiling, and kayaking. In addition to providing access to the surrounding area, more than four to five mountain railroads, cable cars, chairlifts, and ski lifts also provide several opportunities for aerial observation. Skiers and snowboarders can choose among the nearby resorts in the winter, and cross-country skiers can enjoy the large route system. Take a paddle steamer tour around the lakes to take in the view from lower elevations. 4. Lucerne Imagine a mountainous area enclosing a brilliant blue lake, a medieval old town devoid of automobiles, covered bridges, waterfront promenades, frescoed old structures, and sun-drenched plazas with bubbling fountains. It makes sense why Lucerne is a popular tourist destination. This classic Swiss town, known for its musical performances, draws world-famous soloists 
conductors, and orchestras every year to its International Music Festival. One of the top concert halls in the world is located at the Culture and Convention Center. The Chapel Bridge, which was constructed in the 14th century, is one of the city's most recognizable features. The iconic Lion Monument, a moving sculpture of a dying lion in a tiny park, commemorates the valiant deaths of Swiss guards during the French revolutionary attack on the Tuileries. The Swiss Transport Museum, which features vast exhibits on all modes of transportation, including air and space travel, railroad locomotives, and a planetarium, will appeal to history aficionados. 5. Lake Geneva The coasts of some of Switzerland's most well-known cities are lapped by the waters of Lake Geneva, the biggest alpine lake in Europe which shares a border with France. At the point where the Rhone empties into Lake Geneva, the city of Geneva is situated between two attractive snow-capped mountains. The European headquarters of the United Nations are located in this French-speaking city of peace, which emits a charming fusion of French droit de vivre and Swiss architecture. The lake is surrounded by promenades, parks, and gardens, and the old town is a great place to meander amid the historical structures. A well-known site is the Jet Dew, a fountain in Lake Geneva that shoots water 150 meters into the air. The Grand Theater, which hosts international performers, and the Opera House are both cultural landmarks. Lausanne, another lakeside city, is 62 kilometers from Geneva and offers stunning views of the area, the lake, and the distant Alps. Visit the charming cafes, boutiques, and majestic Gothic cathedral in the ancient old town. 6. St. Moritz A must-visit on your list of things to do in Switzerland, St. Moritz is one of the world's top mountain destinations thanks to its mirror-like lakes, glaciers, jagged peaks, alpine forests, and plenty of sunshine. This upscale resort town, which has hosted two Winter Olympics, is known for its opulent hotels and expensive dining establishments. The town, 1,800 meters above sea level, is split into two sections. St. Moritz Dorf is located on a sunny terrace with views of the Lake of St. Moritz. The other area of the city is a health resort with more affordable lodging, called Lakefront St. Moritz Bad on the Valley Floor. Skiing, snowboarding, ice skating, Bobsledding and tobogganing on the renowned Prester Runs 1.2 kilometers are just a few of the many winter activities available. Water sports, riding, and hiking are all popular throughout the summer. Skiing on glaciers is also possible in the summer. 7. Bern The Swiss capital of Bern uses old world beauty and is built on a peninsula of the River Ar. The city's medieval old town is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The tallest cathedral in Switzerland, with panoramic views from its tower, 16th century fountains, the Ziklag medieval clock tower with moving puppets, and six kilometers of shopping arcades, known locally as Lauben, may all be explored by visitors strolling through the cobblestone streets. Beautiful views of the historic town center can be found from the Rose Garden, Excellent museums are among the many tourist attractions in Bern that are just waiting to be discovered. The outstanding galleries, which include the Bern Museum of Art and the Centrum Paul Klee, which houses the largest collection of the artist's works in the entire world, will appeal to art enthusiasts. Don't miss the markets that are hosted in Bundesplatz, which features views of the exquisite Parliament building in Renaissance style. Family outings to the Bear Park are also fun. 8. Lake Lugano and Ticino A delicious taste of the Mediterranean may be found at Lake Lugano, which is located in Ticino, Switzerland's sole official canton that speaks Italian. Even while snow-capped peaks beckon in the distance, the warm environment in this area supports the growth of citrus, figs, palms, and pomegranates. The atmosphere of Italy is palpable in the architecture, piazzas, and passion for excellent food that pours over the Italian borders from the south, east, and west in the towns surrounding Lake Lugano and Lake Maggiore to the west. 
Visitors can visit the lake in one of the white steamers or hire a boat to get a feel for the area. Monte San Salvador provides one of the most breathtaking panoramas of the surrounding landscape, lake, and snow-capped summits. Popular summer vacation destination Lugano is a financial hub and the biggest and most influential town in Ticino. With sunny days, blooming gardens, and palm-lined mansions, Swiss lakeside living takes on a subtropical touch in sun-drenched Locarno on Lake Maggiore, northwest of Lugano. Three spectacular castles in Bellinzona, the canton's capital, are listed on the UNESCO World Heritage List. 9. Oberhofen Castle One of Switzerland's most stunning castles, dating back to the 13th century, is located directly on the shore of Lake Thun and is encircled by a 2.5-hectare park. Oberhofen Castle is a magical fusion of several architectural styles including Bernese Baroque structures, romantic facades, and exotic new areas with Prussian influences. This is the result of the castle changing hands numerous times over the centuries and new owners continually adding rooms to it, including a library and a smoking room. A living museum depicting the lives and times of the feudal communities that resided in the castle and its surrounds from the 16th to the 19th centuries is also housed in the castle. 10. The Rhine Falls The Rhine Falls in Schaffhausen are the biggest falls in Central Europe, spanning 150 meters. When the mountain snow melts in June and July, the falls swell in volume and tumble over a 21-meter high ledge of Jurassic limestone. This is the finest time to come. The viewing platforms on both banks of the river, as well as boat tours up the Rhine, offer fantastic views of the falls, 